mission is to come up with a project that will achieve minus 30% of greenhouse gases by 2035, compared to a 2020 aircraft. ICAP is the aircraft integration project that is transversal to the pillars in clean aviation, integrating at aircraft level for short and medium range aircraft, all the contributions coming from the different other projects. You can imagine ACAP being the center where you have the aircraft and you have all the component projects around. So you have the Ophelia Switch and Heaven project for the engine architecture, upwing for the wing configuration, and wing studies in particular, and you have the Faster H2 project for the fuselage design and hydrogen tank integration. And you have to take all the disciplines into account. You can't just take one discipline and assume it's working, but you have to take the overall aircraft into account to have the synthesis of all the disciplines involved. So in ACAP project, the idea is to bring different design configurations together to have a full-scale and newly developed aircraft. And we have to take care that all the solutions that are developed are meeting the right standards to be integrated into our life cycle inventory for the life cycle assessment to be performed. In clean aviation, we are in phase one. Phase one is to demonstrate the feasibility of the technology to bring them to a certain technology readiness level. And in the phase two, between 2025 and 2030, the plan is to demonstrate that we can actually achieve those technologies for a possible entry into service in 2035. What we hope to achieve is to reduce greenhouse gases by reducing energy consumption on the aircraft significantly in the first place and to support the Horizon Europe goal of a sustainable aviation worldwide. That's why we're investing in technology. That's why we're investing in understanding how technology impacts climate. And that's what clean aviation is about. That's what motivates me a lot. Clean aviation is the perfect framework which allows the cooperation, the collaboration across all the different countries in Europe. We have definitely a challenge in front of us but it's actually all the skills and the capabilities that each of the partners is bringing along and the conviction that they have really to achieve that target can make it happen and will make it happen because the only way to achieve that goal is together. <laughs>